Castle. I own this at, at Whitehall. I'm the owner. My husband, Joel, we uh, bought this house not to do any of this. We just bought the house to live here. Seriously. Uh, we did plan our vineyard and we thought we would do something in 10 or 15 years when it was closer to retirement and that is was not God's plan. So um, we're just, my, my house is almost 300 years old. Um, I have my reserve wine is 1740. We thought the house was built in 1740, but we know the guy that built it was living here before 1710. So who owns a 300 year old house? Nobody. Uh, we're the current caretakers of this property, which is why we are happy to open it up and do so many things like asking about art shows and just all different kinds of things. I think we're different than other people. Um, I do do weddings, I do, I have an Airbnb, I do all kinds of stuff. You host um, fundraisers too? I do fundraisers, way? and um, if you're in my area, I'm probably not going to charge you for that because that. this is sitting here empty. So it's very that. easy. <laughs> yeah. Again, I nobody, I, this barn is yeah, sitting here know, empty. It's beautiful. Even for, even for big parties, um, if you'll do it, like I had a huge surprise party Saturday. I think there were 75 people here. I charged them almost nothing because they came, they bought wine. That's right. You know what? I did charge them a little bit for my tables, I but hardly anything. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 Uh, I do not, but I don't have, I don't so even do have a preferred vendor table. list for my caterers because when we started, our, fr our friends that encouraged us to do this and open um, own Ava Lorraine Brunt. So they kept saying, hey, you will like it. You like people, people like you. It'll be fun. You need to work on the property. So that's kind of how it started. They were on us and we just kept saying, oh, whatever. <laughs> So we just, so really, mm -hmm. that, it, it just took a long time with them saying y'all really should do that. Now my husband's owned lots of businesses when we were in Nashville. I'm a nurse by trade, I did home health up from the south, so really it's just hospitality. Treat that's people right. like you want to be right. treated, um, and that's just kind of a weird thing, you know. Hold the door for the person behind you, just, just be real with people. I may tell you the same story two or three times, but it'll be the same time because I'm going to tell you. <laughs> you want to just that. that. You did. So anyway, uh, we had, this is my winter barn because I can heat it. I'm sorry, I was very cold early, hot earlier and I turned the heaters off. But. So we are up here as soon as it gets cold, but my smaller barn, um, we do do events in there in December and January. The back wall's boarded off now. It's insulated back there. My door's closed. I've got standing heaters and it's comfortable in there. So I'm open 12 months a year. I only close for a couple of weeks, um, probably after New Year's Day, because we usually take a trip and just leave so I can get away and have kind of a business mm -hmm. date time with my husband. So anyway, he was here earlier and he left. I don't know what to say about ourselves. Okay, uh, for about the sixth or seventh year, I am doing my Black Friday and Small Business Saturday. Santa Ago will be here Saturday. I've got a photographer taking pictures for free. I have vendors in both barns. Lord has been here more times than I can count. Um, Janice has been here for for Mary and other people in the past and just for herself. Been here to drink. Yeah, and to drink. Uh, we've got the, the, the Geo um, wine trail going on here. Just, you know, if, if there's something that's fun to do and we can think about it and I can help somebody, what then specials I'm happy to have to do. Uh, I'll probably do something with my wine. I'm sure okay. I will. I'm doing pre-orders for my sangria and my mulled wine at least through New Year's Day, but I live here. If you want something and I'm close, just call me. If I'm here, I'll, I'll sell it to you because it. people tell me that all the time. Oh, it's Monday, you're closed. We didn't, I'm just call me. <laughs> if I'm here, I will, I don't care. I live here, I mean, not in the barn, but. That's right. <laughs>